Hello and welcome. It's time now to take a look at our WordPress website, which was automatically installed during the process of setting up our hosting. Now, if you don't believe me, it's quick and it's already set up. So if I come over here to our domain name, which wasn't showing initially, we can see now that HBBA Training Academy is not showing. Okay, so this is the WordPress website and it's just a blank um, template. Now, the thing is, we can't access this website because we don't have the username and password. Now, this information would be sent to your email account. So let me show you where this information is. So I'm just going to close this tab. So these are the emails that I got from InMotion Hosting. So I'm going to click on the first one. So this is just a receipt just to say that we've uh, purchased the hosting. So let's go back and take a look at the next one. Now, this is a welcome email. Now, this welcome email also has the information to log into your brand new WordPress website. Isn't that cool? Right. So here is the link to log into your WordPress admin dashboard. So I just copied it and I'm going to open a new tab and paste it. So now every time you need to go to your website and access the um, admin dashboard, you need to click this link. So it's your website name forward slash WP hyphen admin. So now it's time to enter our username and password. So I'm going to come over here back to my email and this is our username. So I'm just going to copy it, come over here and paste my username, go back, copy my password like that. And I'm going to paste it here. So for me, to be able to log into my website easily, I'm just going to click on remember me because as you can see, this is a complicated password and I don't want to be going back and forth to my email just to enter my um, password. And what you can also do is I use a password manager called um, one password. It stores all my passwords for me. So that's another way that you can um, save yourself from going to your web uh, to your email to just to get your password. So I'm going to click on login. And I'm going to save this password here in my password manager. Okay, so you can always go ahead here and also save it in your Google Smart Lock. But I'm just going to click never because I have that information. Right. So the first thing you want to do is if you see any updates that needs to be done, go ahead and do those updates because keeping your website updated is very, very good because it saves you from being hacked. So I'm going to come over here and just click highlight it and click update plugins. So what I'm going to do now is just to give you an overview of a WordPress. Okay, so this is a fully functioning website, but in order for you to add pages, add pictures and uh, create your new site the way you want it, you need to log into your WordPress admin dashboard. And this is where we are now. And you'll know that because you have this gray and also an option to go to your dashboard. 